Hey guys, I haven't, no, oh, I haven't did enough bait in a little bit, and seeing that Rooney text me about some white letter, figured I'd show you guys why I was not around today. Helped Dad find himself some rims. My friends at Discount Tire Direct, I bought like. I think it's seven rim sets of rims and tires from them over the years. So I called them up and uh, did a little wheeling and dealing. Got them these wheels for 400 bucks. So we didn't clean it up yet. You can see the kid had the white letters on the ground, but we got home, put it on the lift, and you can see I waxed the wheels. Put the center caps on and I gotta do the sensors and make sure they know they're on each wheel so but yeah you can see this thing turned out to be a sharp little truck it goes pretty damn good too wakes up so saw so where might take the resonator off if he ever wants it a little louder but let's face it, the Chevy was what sounded sweet. The V8. Huh. More stuff falling off the ground. Off the side hill. But anyway. Yeah, so I you know, V6 with an open exhaust or Louder exhaust. I, I no. It don't sound terrible, but not superb either. Yeah, Rooney, this is. I got them for my car, and I mean, just really do wake it up. My little lawn mowing, John Deere, and then the Suburban. <laughs> Think I got it encased or what? I gotta get her out and use it a little bit. And the little update from the yard. That's got another one of these. Had a girl come to look at it and you ever I don't know. Ever deal with somebody who's like a little too picky? Yeah, I could see it was gonna be like Almost felt like I was putting a ring on my finger. With this tractor, you the wed. So, didn't feel like having the headaches. His his buddy dropped this off, and sounds like it's got a bent crank. Dad's buddy, his friend, is uh, one of them hack rones. He fixes things by cobbing them, stripping things. And then you got this guy we got. I found it not too long ago on Craigslist. And it actually didn't have a blown engine for a change. Had a head bolt broke, which was fun. But I used an easy out and then the drill and and just wasn't coming out so we wound up drilling it out and using an easy out and got most of the threads and then he tapped the rest so it works and this PYT is actually a guy bought it and the weirdest thing he said put gas in it and leaked all out some out of fuel line factory or somebody I'm not sure if somebody replaced it a long time ago and didn't route it right or because I know I, we didn't but rubbed right through as a matter of fact this is what I gotta bring it up to the guy you can see right there where it rubbed through you can see some of the poor 15 when we got home with his after getting the, the tires swapped over onto the new rims, brought he brought the lift out here, 
and we picked it up and I helped him best I could underneath. I waxed the wheels while he used pour 15 on a little bit of rust you'd see on the on the frame from sitting and stuff and so he's got it pretty good. So he's happy. Alright. Well the chipmunk spotted me. What? Well you expect more stuff? Time for your bedtime. I ain't giving you more peanuts. Are you crazy? <laughs> hmm. Hmm. That's the one I fed out of my hand, so. Alright guys, well glad Mr. Rooney was able to find that pen and it worked out good for him. So maybe I should do that on dad's flips. Make him wait later. <laughs> My back is killing me. All right, gents. Well, I'm gonna go put the bird feeders away and make the yard bear-proof for tonight. Well, nothing's ever bear-proof, but hopefully they don't come around. Why, you following me? Yeah, you're following me, ain't you? you little sucker. I'll I'll spill some seed out of the feeder for you. All right, gents. Talk to you later. So, little update from the from the yard. Dad's truck's coming along, and he's he's about to start piddling, stop piddling with the tractors for a bit. He's gonna start working on things around the house he has to do. So, but in the meantime, I'll give you an update here and there. <laughs>